Welcome back to the Crypto Clown World channel. I am your host with the honks, Jason Bruce. Honking back into a new year, folks. This is the 2nd of January, 2024. Can you believe it? 2024, people. Holy cow. Let me turn this music down just a little bit here. It may just be my headphones that are loud cut that down too and I'm gonna jump into the price action real quick here I'm gonna try to keep this video short but you can see here that uh, the Santa rally is continuing into the new year we've got all coins popping off everywhere uh, green all over the board except for uh, just a few select coins here um, Pex ecosystem hasn't been doing that great BSV had a pullback uh, after an odd pump, uh, HNT pulling back a little bit after uh, quite a bit of bullish price action there and tons of other altcoins that are pumping. Uh, Aster is leading the way. Um, I haven't jumped into that ecosystem and I was looking at it at the bottom and I didn't buy it. It's done pretty well since then, so I missed out on that one. But I'm going to jump over into the Bitcoin price action for this morning and we are breaking out again on the 15 minute candles so it looks like bitcoin's in kind of a little bit of a parallel uptrend channel there uh stochastics are moving in a positive direction and rsi is pointing up on the 15 minute uh keep in mind we're pretty extended here uh, on the hourly, this is a little bit of a rising pattern there with some bearish divergence. But we did also form a little bit of hidden bullish there and pumped out of it. So uh, there's probably higher price targets coming, folks, if you just take a quick measured move here. Like, even if it's just that, take it conservatively. Oops. let me grab this thing here you know conservatively you're going up to about 47,000 and then like if you're measuring a little more aggressively you're going up to this price target around 48,000 so I do believe 48 and even 50,000 are on the table here very soon we've been talking about that as you all know Ethereum price action, uh, very volatile this morning as well. I did get in uh, this move here out of this triangle, but I let us hand this thing on the way up and uh, sold way too soon. And now this is popping up again. And that was actually after I had bumped up the margin significantly. So um, that's my bad, but we're going to get there, folks. We're going to get there. Uh, lots of good, profitable positions on the way. ETH BTC kind of suffering a little bit, though. Uh, Bitcoin pushing the rest of the pairs uh, in terms of their U.S. dollar value, but uh, not looking the greatest in terms of that BTC pair. But there is some hidden bullish divergence forming as long as this point of control holds. So we'll see how that goes. BNB is currently flagging out outside of this larger pattern here on the 15 minute. I am in a very nicely leveraged long trade from $235 on BNB. And I have already paid myself for that trade. And we're looking to make it a potentially life altering trade. Um, possibly $30,000, $50,000 if it tops out where I'm looking to exit, uh, I did jump into a long on Caspa. Uh, my entry here at this orange level at 11,126. I did miss my take profit actually. I moved this line down just to make sure it was a little more in confluence, but I missed my target on this by 0 0.00006. So those things happen, folks, and I'm not going to beat myself up about it. But when you're getting that close, you really have to give yourself credit more than anything. So I'll give myself a little pat on the back this morning. If you like the technical analysis so far, folks, and the slight bit of narcissism, 
Uh, make sure to honk the like button, get subscribed to the channel, and honk the bell for notifications as well if you're new to the channel this year. Uh, we do appreciate you jumping on today. We're going to bring you these videos in a timely manner going forward as I did take just a little bit of time off for the new year. So, uh, CASPA consolidating nicely here uh, this morning in a little bit of a falling wedge pattern. And I've seen CASPA break out of these patterns recently uh, with a bullish bias. So may potentially see something like that again where we could move up into this range between about uh, 12.3 to 12.7 cents on that move all right and uh there is some hidden bullish divergence at work there and stochastics are favorable on the 15 minute time frame right now could see further retracement however to the golden pocket that level is around 11.4 and point of control just below that at 11.3 so another trade i'm in right now is mana uh, we did take that trade from 0.52 area after scalping off a few times in this range to increase the bag um i then increased the leverage on that so we are holding that at like a 30x all right so we did see this move play out nicely a little volatility upside and downside now with some bullish divergence that came in on the 15 and that's holding us up right now with stochastics in a favorable position so uh, things are looking pretty good there i did get a little underwater on this uniswap trade but um, things are looking potentially like they might be starting to move there as well with this falling wedge so we'll see how things get going for uniswap this morning there is a bit of bullish divergence printing there as well so that's a good thing um, so some short-term divergences printing on the market here um, that's definitely good we just need btc to hold the line here and keep in mind we did have some important closures over the last few days the daily uh, has had a very large breakout and we are well above uh, this point of control locally and uh, this pattern that was formed here uh, this bull flag uh, which we were way ahead of the crowd on when people were talking about 37k 30k and much lower uh, we came in and highlighted the fact that there was divergences that were holding us up. So keep in mind, once again, we've been heading you in the right direction uh, on these videos for weeks now. Uh, again, on your way out, please, folks, if you like any of the content that you just saw, make sure that you honk the like button and uh, make sure that you're also getting subscribed to this channel and you're hitting the bell for notifications as well. That way we do bring you these videos in a timely manner in the future going forward and uh, just keep in mind as well folks nothing that I said here should be construed as financial advice get yourself a financial advisor do your own due diligence and research before taking any coin project research uh, or trade under your wing there so with that in mind I'm Jason Bruce this is crypto clown world I'm gonna get honking on out of here folks and uh, have yourselves a fantastic Tuesday. Take care. Much love. God bless.